okay hello and welcome back guys to new grid and in this tutorial we will we'll make a set preferences app with which will save and retrieve the data from the set preferences before processing you will get a link in the description and also floating on your screen that says the android study example i wrote this post and you can find this to say the time if you don't have time you can say the text version of this just go to this link too long i know i can't say this okay so let's come back to our end studio let me set up this come to end studio and now open your activity to main xml design the layout whatever you want i already have design i am show you this or forget this one let's create a new one the plain text button and the text view that's all what we need text button edit text and and what's more maybe it is the infer constructs so it will automatically do this so now we have our things let's change this first to name hint to name now open up your main activity declare the variables first we have to write the variables private text view with text view private edit text with the text and again the private but this time it's going to be button with another button and now what we're going to do to declare these variables text view equals to find view id r dot id dot text view and i'm using control d button same here edit text button so now what i'm going to do is to create a new method the private void display name and another private void method with save name okay now we have two methods though both are empty so now let's execute them first i'm executing the display name and then button dot set on click listener new and colon name now i'm executing the save name not this one save name here okay now what we need is we have to create two variables let's where it goes yep the first one going to be private static final or you can directly use private string but i am using private static final string with say not this one shared brave name equals to username so they both are important and this one is going to be key name this time just add a key before this or after that's all you know on you and now it display name the display name what we need is to check or not check we need a string name equals to edit text dot get text dot to string dot trim okay now check if if name dot is empty the text dot set errors whatever you want oops no name it talks dot request focus so it will focus to the ready text and then we need set prefs set pref friends will name it as a uh, sp equals to get set references and now we need a set preference name and the mode is going to be private because we are handling it in our one app and then a new set preference is dot editor editor e equals to sp dot edit e dot put string is key name with name that's all and e dot apply because i can use the commit but you can see this is suggesting me to use apply instead of commit so i will use apply you can use commit only thing on you the text to set text to null 
and then display name but this is optional you want to do or not so display name i think i've done something wrong there it should be not here it should be there so now it will don't re not recall this function again and again and now in the display name what we are going to do it's set preferences as we equal get set preferences with set preferences name dot mode private and then a set preferences or we can use string string name equals to sb dot get string key name with null because the default value is null and if name not this one if name is not equals to null then what we're going to say text view dot set text well welcome with the name that's it now our app is ready to hit so if you if you haven't subscribed to our channel please do subscribe it helps me a lot so let's see what we can do where are the yep yeah. i think i should pause this video now oh just wait let's wait view because there is a no save saved set preference so i'm going to say i get sudam and then hit the button you'll see well my suda and now if i close the save in background you will see that what the fuck is this yep uh, yeah tap set preferences so that's this welcome say welcome i get suda again say taste button welcome test and if you make this app in background it also works as accepted and say welcome test welcome 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 so thanks for watching consider subscribe and like this video hopefully you enjoyed i'll see you in the next one